Hi everybody, how to draw the short run monopolistic competition diagram. Let's get cracking. We want to go straight to the checklist. Remember this checklist is a mental idea. Before you start drawing, what are you trying to show in this diagram? Well beyond the basics, you're looking to show your revenue curves being slightly more elastic than in Monopoly and you're also trying to show super normal profit. So let's get moving on this. How do we do that? Well on the y-axis we have to show price, costs and revenue. We can show all three. And on the x-axis, quantity. Now it's the same procedure as your Monopoly diagram. Go and watch that construction if you haven't already and it's basically following the same pattern. The only difference now is your revenue curves draw them slightly shallower, right? more elastic. So something like this is perfect. So that's AR which is equal to demand, label it like that. MR which is twice as steep, so it's slightly shallower than what you're used to drawing in Monopoly. Uh, then you can draw your average cost, like that, label that AC, and then your marginal cost is your Nike tick, cutting AC at its minimum point, like that. Okay, so exactly the same procedure as with Monopoly. Then we need to go to the profit maximizing point, firms of monopolistic comp, we assume the profit maximizes. That takes us to MC equals MR, that gives us a quantity, call it Q1. We read the price of the AR curve. Let's call that P1. And then, as always, we need to work out the level of profit. To do that, we compare average revenue and average cost at the quantity level of Q1. So at Q1, average revenue is up here, where P1 is. And average cost is down here. So let's take that point across and call that C1. That leaves us a beautiful little box, which we can shade in and that is the super normal profit that exists in the short run in monopolistic competition. Right, if we're happy with that, we then go through our checklist. All right? Very useful to do this, to make sure nothing has been left out, no mistakes have been made. Have we aced the diagram? Have we labelled our axis? Yes, we have. Have we labelled our curves? Yes, we have. Have we labelled our equilibria? The profit maximising equilibria? Yes, we have. And also the C1 on the y-axis is a useful thing to put on. Are our revenue curves drawn a bit shallower than we used to? Yeah, that's fine. Have we shown super normal profit? Yes, we have beautifully labelled and clear. The diagram is big, you will have drawn it in pencil and with a ruler as well to present it properly. That's the diagram, practice it, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.